Hi everybody, uh, hope you're doing well. I am doing well myself. Uh, I'm here at work. It's the end of the day and I'm about to head home and go through traffic and all that. And uh, you know, but I can't wait to get home and start putting something together for you. Um, as you can see, I already have a rough, uh, a rough drawing done. And uh, what I wanna do with this rough drawing is I'm gonna take the rough drawing and I'm gonna put it into Adobe Illustrator and I'm gonna create a vector version of, uh, of, this, of this illustration that I wanna do. Um, it's a different approach. Um, I haven't done a vector illustration in any of the other episodes, and so uh, I, I wanna do that for you uh, for this episode. Now, I also noticed that uh, when, as I was uploading my previous episode that uh, I accidentally skipped episode 12 and uh, there's an episode 11 and then I was uploading, I had uploaded episode 13 and then I uploaded something else after that and I noticed that there is no episode 12. So um, I feel like I owe you episode 12 and I don't know, I don't know what happened. <laughs> I don't know how I missed that but, um, but nonetheless, uh, here you go. This is gonna be episode 12. So um, again, you know, just, uh, I'm gonna be illustrating something for you and you can illustrate whatever you want and I'll go ahead and illustrate whatever I want and let's just have fun doing that. Um, so, here we go, episode 12.
Alright, uh, I hope you're liking it so far. Uh, this is the vector line work and uh, again I'm using Adobe Illustrator. Um, I guess now the next stage or the next step is to uh, apply the color on there. Uh, I'll be using Illustrator for that too. And then uh, I think as I do the color work um, I'm gonna apply some of the stylization and maybe play around with the tones. Um, and yeah, you know, it's a process and I'll get it done soon. Um, hopefully, hopefully you like it then. So uh, hang tight. Uh, we'll, well, let's see how it turns out uh, after the next stage. And uh, yes, um, let's see what happens. Alright, so that was the color process. Um, I think what I want to do now is I think I'm going to take the vector and I'm going to put it into Photoshop. I think I'm going to experiment with the uh, stylization a little bit more, maybe tweak around with the background, maybe make uh, some other adjustments. I do want to take this file and separate it uh, in, in, uh, in After Effects and I want to create like a third dimensional effect as I've done in the past with some illustrations, so um, so I'm gonna I'm just gonna you know uh, mess around with the Photoshop stylization a little bit more, and uh, let's see let's see how it turns out.
All right, so now I'm gonna take this Photoshop file and I'm gonna put it into After Effects and I'm gonna separate the layers and I'm gonna, you know, um, create the illusion of third dimension. So um, I think it's almost done. Uh, who knows? We'll see how long it takes uh, for me to do the next thing, but uh, this is fun. So um, let's see how it turns out now. That was fun. Uh, hopefully you enjoyed watching how that came together. Uh, it was definitely fun making that for you. Um, again, I went from a rough drawing to Illustrator to do the vector, and then from Illustrator to Photoshop to do the final stylization, I guess. And then from Photoshop over to After Effects to create the third dimensional illusion. So um, it, it, was, it was fun. It, uh, it was a long process, but I got through it, and um, hope you enjoyed it. Um, anywho, till next time, take care.